Hey, it's Adelia with Direct Cannabis Network, and I am here with Shane Coronado, the founder of Shane's Tea. I want to thank you for taking the time to speak with us today. Um, if you could please let us know a, a little bit about you first. Oh, well, thank you for having me. <laughs> um, well, my name is Shane, obviously, and this is Shane's Tea. It wasn't so much the interest in the cannabis business that you know really started me back into this. Um, it was. It was really just a, a, a need to create something. There was no other time than the present to really get started on something that I thought, I think is going to be um, really great. Was there a reason why tea? Why tea? Gosh, <laughs> I, you know, it came down to a few questions uh, from friends of mine that really wanted to get into the business. Mm -hmm. And I started consulting because people knew that I knew how to do these different things and grow and put together you know, uh, grow facilities and that kind of thing. What I did understand was marketing. And I saw that not only was this the perfect opportunity to create something in the cannabis business, in a growing market, in something that is going to be legal and also the market and the trend. Mm -hmm. So I looked I looked at a bunch of different dispensaries and I figured, well, what is the gap in the market? Everybody's got a chocolate bar, everybody has a caramel or a candy or whatever. Yeah. Popcorn to gummy bears. Yeah. But there's no drinks. There are a couple of sodas and things like that there, but nobody's doing a tea. And what do I love most? my Snapple Raspberry Iced Tea, or a Snapple Peach Iced Tea. I mean, those are, in all honesty, my favorite drinks. Like when I go to 7-Eleven or I go somewhere, I go and I grab a Snapple, or an Arizona. You yeah. know, like one of those iced teas. Arizona's mine, there we go. And I love it because it's naturally brewed and it tastes so good, and I don't have to worry about all the other ingredients. Which is why I make my drinks all natural. I will never deviate from that. So when it comes to the creation of your teas, it's brewing. You brew it like a regular tea. You... Exactly. Okay. And your flavors are natural and all natural. Do you prefer your teas hot? Can I make? Can I? I do prefer cold. I like them cold. Mm -hmm. I also like them hot. I mean, it's it's really up to your right? preference. Yeah. You know, you can. There's they taste great over you know just like a little bit in a glass. They're pretty potent. Yeah. <laughs> so you, you'd only want to drink a little bit. I know that looks, it, it, it is delicious and you can't really taste the cannabis in it. Yeah, when you say Snapple, I want the Yeah, whole thing. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, you can't really do that. <laughs> well, that, that means you can have it throughout the day. A little you bit can. at a time. A little bit at a time is great. And for most people, it's more than enough. What other flavors do you carry? I have uh, I have a half and half, which is my take on Arnold Palmer. I also do a, a chocolate cherry tea. I do um, honey green tea, which is a, 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 many people's favorite. Yeah. It has a little hint of mint in it. Um, and a chai. I started with chai. That's what I. That's the one that I was like, ooh, I want to try that. Yeah, <laughs> chai right now is a is. It's not, it's all, it never has been easy because okay. you actually do have to, it's an eight hour brew process. Wow. wow. Yeah, so it's a whole three to four hours longer of a process than it is this. And it really is a labor of love. And um, it's just a matter of space right now. I will start brewing chai again mm -hmm. very soon to all of you out there that are waiting on chai. It's coming, all right? Be ready. <laughs> Be ready. Are you only located in, in Los Angeles right now? Right now I'm only in Los Angeles. Okay. I am working on agreements in other states as well. Oh. Uh, but you know, I, it's kind of weird. Like, why would I not? Why would I not work out relationships here in, in the state? Yeah. <laughs> but in places where there's re it's recreational already, might as well open those doors as well. They need to try. Shane's there's no. They need. To, everybody needs to try Shane's too. Is there anything that you would like to share with our viewers? Other than my tea, <laughs> I can't think of anything else. <laughs> Where can they find you um, on your social media? Oh, yeah. You can find me on uh, Shane's Tea, at, or at Shane's Tea on Instagram, on Facebook, Shane's Tea, shanestea.com. So email him your flavors that you have. Email me. I am Sh Shane at Shane's Tea. <laughs> so you can email me your requests. 
Well, I want to thank you so much for your time today. I really appreciate it. I'm excited to try that chai tea when it comes out. Well, you're going to try Get some me on of this. Speed I'm going to leave you with a bottle today. <laughs> <There> <laughs> Perfect. Well, thank you again so much. I appreciate thank it. Thank you so much for having me. Mm -hmm. <laughs>